Hi, this is the fifth video of the fifth week of the ISTF chapter funding workshop. This is a short video on reporting. Now, if you receive a grant from a funder, you are usually responsible for reporting back to them, both on the results of your project and how you spent the funds. So when you are applying for a grant, please research the reporting re requirements before you submit your applications. So you know what will be required of you. And just about every funder will require a report on a project. So you will want to give them usually both how you use the funds and the results on your project and make sure you comply with all of the reporting requirements. I'll give you a couple of examples of reporting re requirements for small grants. From the Rufford Small Grants Program, you will need to submit updates on your project throughout the year and submit a final report on completion and publish the results of your project on your website. So if you complete these reporting requirements, then you can apply for a second grant from them. So this, and then the other one is the to example is the Prince Bernard Nature Fund. So if you receive a grant from them, they want you to turn in a final report within two months after the project ends. And the two parts will include um, a course on the spend, spending of their funds and also on your project results. Now, many of these funders want to do publicity about the programs they fund. So they will be very happy if you give them a couple of pictures that they can then post on a website. So for your homework, I want you to look at the two funding sources you have identified to which you would like to submit your proposal, then research their reporting requirements and tell us about it, how often you need to report the deadlines and the content that they want you to include. Thanks, and we'll see you next week.